Hey, Pastor Steve Waldron here. A question I get a lot is, what about yoga and the Christian? Well, first of all, you have to know the term yoga means to be yoked together. You know, you call a practitioner of Eastern religions a yogi, you know. And so, uh, yoga is basically a series of positions that are, like you have sun salutations and things like this, that are to false deities and false gods. So, whereas I, I've done this video on the Christian and diet and exercise and the limits that God seems to put on their bodily exercise, profit as little and all this kind of stuff, nobody's against stretching. You know, we all need to stretch, get our blood circulating and all this. But when it is a series of things, it is a branch of Hinduism, which obviously is a false religion. It's We as Christians would know that that is a false thing. It's a worship 33 three million deities that yoga is is a portion of Hinduism and and some other things too you know I've been told by people who've done yoga that say it has to do uh, with certain um, immoral practices also we should not be doing things that come out of the world a bad tree cannot produce good fruit so be very careful you know and the same would apply to martial arts think about that martial the god of mars the god of war that the uh, Anunnaki came down and taught, according to the Sumerians, these fallen angels. And you have the, what is it, the Qi and all this, or the Qi or something, the Yin and the Yang. All these are Eastern religious concepts. So again, it's not bad to know how to defend yourself. You know, you need to say in the name of Jesus and, and uh, these type things. But to go through these, these things, um, like it says a bishop it can be no striker you know he can't be given to all these bishops that are into MMA and all that that's totally non-biblical and unbiblical so yoga would not be for Christians it would not be for true biblical Christians and I know we tend to say well I'm going to do what culture says and incorporate my Bible into the culture I believe in Christian yoga I'm thinking about Jesus when I'm clearing my mind and all this kind of stuff and all this you need to be careful clearing your mind too. You need to keep your mind full of whatsoever things are true, honest, just, pure, lovely, of a good report, any virtue, any praise, think on these things, scripture memory, because uh, nature abhors a vacuum and in the spiritual realm it does too. You know, you clear your mind, you're liable to have demons come inside of you. So these are all poses, you know, the doggy position, all this kind of stuff that represent things to pagan deities. And we are not supposed to eat meat offered unto idols. We're not supposed to eat at the uh, idol's temple. I think that that would apply to yoga as well. And also the martial arts. But God bless you. Just live for Jesus Christ and examine everything we do in accordance with the scripture. And don't get messed up with uh, every wind of doctrine that comes through. So God bless you. I love you in Jesus' name.